Greetings, my fellow warriors. In the realm of gods and monsters, there exists a warrior unlike any other. His name is Kratos, the ghost of Sparta, a demigod forged in the fires of vengeance and redemption. With every stroke of the pencil, we bring to life the legend of Kratos, a man who defied the gods themselves. His journey began in ancient Greece, where betrayal and tragedy set him on a path of relentless fury. Tricked by Ares, the god of war, Kratos was condemned to a life of torment, haunted by the memories of his lost family. But from the ashes of his past, Kratos rose, wielding the blades of chaos, weapons chained to his very soul. He became a godslayer, toppling the mighty Olympians, including Zeus, his own father. Yet his story did not end there. In the frozen lands of the Norse realm, Kratos sought a new beginning. With the Leviathan Axe, a weapon of immense power and grace, he faced new gods and monsters. This axe, forged by the legendary Holdra brothers Brock and Sindri, who are also known for creating Thor's hammer Mjolnir, was crafted for Fae, Kratos' second wife, to counterbalance the destructive power of Mjolnir. It symbolized his quest for redemption and his role as a protector. The Leviathan Axe is no ordinary weapon. It is a tool of immense power, a testament to its mystical craftsmanship. As Kratos battles foes like Baldur and Thor, the axe proves to be an indispensable ally. This weapon, a gift from his beloved wife Fae, represents his transformation from a vengeful warrior to a guardian of the realms. Kratos is more than a warrior. He is a symbol of strength, resilience, and the unyielding spirit of a man seeking redemption. As we draw his form, we capture the essence of a legend, a tale of epic proportions that transcends time and myth. This is Kratos, the ghost of Sparta, the god of war. What's your favorite character? Tell me in the comments and I might draw it someday. And of course, like and subscribe if you want. It means a lot to me.